Hello, my name is Aaliyah and welcome to my channel. This is my first YouTube video so I'm a little bit nervous but that's okay. In this video I'm going to be sharing how to start making your dream life your reality. This video will be mainly for the people who are stuck and don't know where to start with achieving their dream life. So my dream is to be successful, fulfilled, travel the world, take great care of my family and just live life on my own terms. I also want to inspire others to go after their dream life like me. And I want to show people what is possible for them by me living my dream life. I just know I'm meant for more than a 9 to 5 job or working for someone else. So here's what you can do to start making your dream life your reality. Number one is to get crystal clear on your goals. First off, you have to get crystal clear on what exactly your goals are. Getting super clear on your goals is super important because you need to know where you want to go and how you need to get there. Just so you won't feel lost and want to give up. Write your goals out on a piece of paper, a journal, your notes, whatever's easiest. Number two is to make a vision board. If you're anything like me, you love to see things to get a clearer vision of what it is that you're working towards instead of it just being in your mind. Vision boards are basically just a big collage of pictures that represent things that you want in your life. So you just get your pics from Pinterest and then you use Canva to make a collage. I'll be posting a more in-depth video on how to make a vision board so keep an eye out for that. Once you've made it, literally put it anywhere. You can put it on your computer and your phone background, you can print it out, put it on your wall, anywhere. It's just so you can use it as a source of motivation to help you achieve those things on it as much as possible. You could also just go on Pinterest and pin photos of your dream life to a board that you name dream life. I do that every morning or when I need a motivation boost. And number three is researching. Sounds pretty obvious but you need to start researching what it is that you want to do to get you to that dream life. For example, I've been watching videos on how to start a YouTube channel. Because how are you going to get there without knowing what it is and how to do it? Expand your knowledge base a bit. And you never know, researching might actually make you change your mind. At this point, you can pivot and change to something else. Number four is planning. Come up with a plan on how you're going to achieve those goals that you set for yourself. So earlier we discussed writing down your goals and now it's time to break them down into small steps. This makes them seem so much easier and more achievable. Make an action plan with these broken down goals. You need to follow through with this action plan in order for you to achieve those goals. And number five is to just start now. The key to success is to start before you are ready because you're never gonna feel ready. I literally do not feel ready right now doing this video. <laughs> but I'm stepping out of my comfort zone because I know that it will be worth it in the long run and it's getting me one step closer to my dream life. So yeah, start now, start before you're ready, take action and get out of your comfort zone because there is no growth in the comfort zone. Number six, start off with one hour every day, unless you have more time to spare, of course. But one hour is really all you need to start working on your plan to achieve your goals because at least it's something. And baby steps every day are bigger than no steps at all. This is a great example of the compound effect. The compound effect is basically the principle that you reap huge rewards from small but consistent actions over a long period of time, rather than massive but short changes. Number seven is journaling. I love journaling. It can be used in so many ways throughout this whole process. You can use it to write out your goals, your dreams, affirmations, daily intentions, things you're grateful for, and to help track growth and progress. I feel like journaling is really important because if you aren't checking in on yourself and how you're progressing, then you might not know where to go next, what you could improve, or what you could change. Just give yourself a few minutes every day to reflect on how everything is going with executing your plan. This will really help to keep you on track with your action plan. Number eight is to stick to your plan and don't give up. Most people never attain their goals because they quit along the way. 
People give up due to many reasons. Lack of discipline, consistency, resilience, patience, and self-doubt, to name a few. In order to change your external reality, you must first change your internal reality. Self-improvement and mindset growth is another very big key to success and achieving your goals. Consider working and improving on these qualities. Do some research, watch some videos, and ultimately come back to the reason why you started this in the first place. It's because you have goals and dreams that you want to live out, so don't give up on that. If and when you're on the brink of giving up, just remember to think about how it will benefit your future self rather than your current self. I also really recommend writing down and saying affirmations when you do your daily journaling. Set timers throughout the day to repeat these affirmations. They can eventually really help to improve your mindset and your belief in yourself. You can find affirmations anywhere online. I use Pinterest and the I Am app. So if you pair all of that with your action plan, there's a big possibility that you will achieve your goals. However, it really does all depend on how focused you are, how hard you work to make it happen, and how consistent you are in reaching the finish line. Lastly, I just wanted to remind you that everyone's journey is different. Try not to get caught up in comparing yourself to others and where they're at in their journeys. Just enjoy your unique journey and process to getting where you want to be. So that is all for this video. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it and found it helpful. Let me know in the comments your thoughts and what you do to help you get closer to your dream life. I would also really appreciate it if you gave this video a thumbs up and subscribe to join my dream community. And I'll see you in the next video. Mwah. Hello, my name is... Oh yeah, that's right, I have to look at the camera. Okay, let's try again. Get all those nerves out. Positive vibes. I'll be posting a more in-depth version. Why do I keep saying that? I'll be posting a more in-depth video. It's gonna say version again. Okay, start. <laughs> it was a struggle from start to end. Let's try that again. Jink! Hydration is key. No, okay. Get out of your comfort zone because there is no growth in the comfort zone. I like that line. It's very good. Num oh. Number six. Massive but short changes. Whew, I need a drink again.